My name's uh, Sean McNulty. I'm originally from Canada, uh, the west coast of Canada, like Vancouver Island. Before joining the NUS MBA, I was an FX spot trader in Toronto, Ontario. I had done an exchange at NUS during my undergrad, so I was a big fan of the university. It was the only school uh, I wanted to do an MBA at, so I applied to the NUS, NUS MBA program after uh, working for a few years uh, in, in, on Bay Street in Canada, which is kind of like Canada's Wall Street, and, uh, and fortunately was accepted in. I graduated in 2017 from the program, uh, joined uh, JP Morgan after the program as an FX option trader, so for me, it was was more about uh, moving to Singapore and, uh, and relocating here and kind of staying on the same career track. So I interned at JP Morgan, which is where I ended up, uh, like after the internship, I signed the contract with them and joined them like after graduating. Uh, how I pursued uh, the hiring process uh, for me, it was really just getting out there as much as possible. Uh, so I, I went to all the different career events, uh, all the big banks come to campus, so like JP Morgan, Goldman Sachs, Bank of America. Uh, and, and in fact, uh, so I went to all the recruiting events, uh, made sure I talked to as many people as possible. I sent resumes to everybody. Uh, and, uh, and frankly, I think because our NUS has such an amazing reputation worldwide, it really opened all the doors I needed to, to get the career I wanted. Uh, currently, I am a cryptocurrency derivatives trader, which is a very new uh, set of finance. So coming from an FX options background, uh, obviously cryptocurrencies are kind of expanding and becoming more established. And as a result, there's now a derivatives market in cryptocurrencies that's probably about a year and a half old. Uh, and so I decided uh, after you know, six, seven years in sort of the traditional finance space to kind of branch out and, uh, and try something a little bit different uh, and something that was exciting. And frankly, I like the idea of being a pioneer in the space because it is a brand new market. And so getting a chance to, you know, being part of setting up a brand new market is, is very exciting. And frankly, it ties really well into the whole uh, MBA educational experience. One of the things I enjoyed most about the MBA program uh, was the flexibility within it. So some of my classmates graduated within one year. I myself chose to extend mine to two years, which allowed me to do the two full semester exchanges, uh, the two short exchanges, uh, the one study trip, uh, and as well as an internship uh, within the whole program's uh, scope. And I think that that's one of the big advantages of the MBA is you can really uh, customize the time frame to work within uh, your, your uh, plans and, and goals uh, associated with your career. Yeah, so within the MBA program, there was a lot of opportunities to do a lot of different things. So first off was the student council involvement. So in my undergrad, I didn't get involved in student council at all. So it was a brand new thing for me within the MBA. Uh, and I'm really glad I did it because it does, uh, you know, you, like with anything, the more you put into it, the more you get out of it. So by spending all this extra time around classes, being involved in student council and different events. I just got so much more out of that than I ever would have thought just in terms of uh, learning and just fun new experiences. So, I mean, that was a fantastic, I guess, additional benefit of the MBA. So I think the people who got the most out of the program, uh, they had a clear goal because that there's no question they need to be aiming at something, to, a target of some sorts. At the same time, they didn't let that uh, narrow their scope within the program. So I think that that would be my, my number one advice would just be to have a clear objective in terms of where you want to go with your career. But while pursuing that objective, you know, taking everything that's around you within the program.